Hello guys, in today's video I'm going to show you how to fix Warzone 3 stuck in a lobby and you can join lobby on your PC. This tutorial will be quick, uh, just make sure to subscribe to this channel and leave a like on this video if you will find this guide useful. So first of all you want to open up Call of Duty settings, so at the top you will see gear icon, click on it and then choose on more, manage files. You want to make sure that uh, Call of Duty Warzone is installed. As you can see, I need to install it now. Um, and after that, you will see uninstall button. So you will know that you have installed it. So this might be an, an issue why it's not working. If you have installed it, then that's great. You can go ahead and exit um, Call of Duty. Now after that you want to open up your settings and on settings you want to be on network and internet and on VPN you want to make sure that no VPN is connected now. Uh, if you will make sure that it's not then you can close this. Now after that you want to go on search and go to CMD command prompt but you want to run it as administrator just make sure to do this. Uh, after that uh, this will pop up and now you will need to enter a few commands here they are ip config flush dns ip config register dns release renew and um, net sh winsock reset so you need to enter all of those so let's go ahead and copy them um, basically just enter them click enter then another one and basically do all of this Renew. And after the last one, that is the Winsock reset basically, you will need to restart your PC. As you can see, it's written here that you need to restart your computer in order to in order for these to take effect. So just go ahead and restart your PC. Now, if that didn't work, you also want to go to a Windows Defender Firewall and allow an app to go through the firewall. So basically turn it off for uh, Warzone. So just click change settings and allow another app and add Call of Duty here. As you can see, I already have it here, but basically you will need to add Warzone also right there. Click OK and then save it. And that's pretty much it. If this video was helpful, comment down below, like this video, and I will see you next time. Bye.